In this video, we're going to quickly go over how to register your data as branch versioned. Here I've got a feature class which contains some house footprints in a new neighborhood development area, and we want to be able to share this data set with our organization so our users can add or edit the features easily. If we branch version this data, it'll be easy for those users to access the feature class versions through services in an application or a web service. The first step in versioning this data is to register it as versioned. I made a connection to an enterprise database as the data owner, and you can see it here on the catalog pane under databases. I can see all of my GeoDatabase feature datasets and feature classes and add them to my map view. From here, we need to add a couple quick fields to meet the requirements for branch versioning. First, we need to check the workspace through the GeoDatabase connection properties. So right click on the database connection and point to the GeoDatabase connection properties. And then here in versioning type, I just need to make sure it's set to branch. Now I can add the fields by right clicking on my feature class and pointing to manage. First, I need to add global IDs, which will run a quick geoprocessing tool. And then I'll also do manage enable editor tracking, which should also run quickly. And these will meet the base for table requirements for branch versioning. Now I can right click on it one more time, go to manage and register as versioned. Now that it's done, we can move on to the next step, which is publishing. Thank you. 